Right, okay, so this is part 5 of the Let's Play. So I'm going to be going through, um, hopefully getting past the fourth castle in this one. And then I'm probably going to try and get to the, the two different routes. There's the one over the top and there's the one along the bottom. The one along the bottom is only two levels, I think they're slightly easier. So we'll do that first. <coughs> first of all though, I'm going to go to my favourite room. Always a good idea to do that, because that way then <coughs> you go in. With a cape or a fire flower. So, this level I think is marginally easier than the <coughs> other one. So, it's a bit more of a warm up. The early castles come thick and fast. Um, the big ones. Don't have many levels between them. Forest of Illusion, I think there's quite a few levels before you do that. So yeah, if you can remember, you don't have to do all the levels to get to <coughs> the end. But on this playthrough, I'm going to see play as many of them as possible. Or as many of them as I can anyway. Just do this to get the coin. Oh, get back here. Get out of time. Let's go back for the coin, why not? Oh! Oh! This is an interesting one. Nice! Got to be really careful with these guys. Although you only need to fight him down there. Leave those boxes. And then we've got him. Oh, we've lost Yoshi. That's okay. I just see Yoshi sometimes as a, a helping hand, just as a, a bonus jump. Castle 4. Now, when I play this, I don't usually get this far. But I have beaten this castle before. you got hit. Oh. Oh. No, I didn't quite make it. <coughs> yeah. Coughing quite a lot. Which isn't great. Don't have any safety nets now though. 
but you can jump on them, which is good. Some parts of this game, it is a lot easier to be small. Because you can duck under stuff. There we go. Right, didn't have to cough the last time. Jump. Oh, got hit. Got a bit looby now. Oh. The problem is, it's going to get quite low. Oh! Those fire, those fireballs. I think what I'm going to do. I'm going to risk it and go back because I need at least a, <coughs> a bit of health insurance here. I see risk it, go back. Mainly because it's just. It makes life a little bit easier. Because really, you need to be able to take. To wrap it up with the audio. Yeah, you need to be able to take a hit, which I think is probably a good idea to do on those fireballs. You've got to be quick, but if the fire, if you just lose the timing with the fireballs, it's not. Excuse me, it's not really that difficult. There, are, the funny thing is, this game is just really weird. There's some levels that. Are actually easier, I think, than some of the ca that later on that are actually easier than this. It's still about getting the timing. I think I needed to do that just so that I've got a bit of health insurance. Yeah, this bit this bit isn't too bad. This is a, a nice little callback to earlier castles. Only difference is you've got spikes and a little bit of a maze. And some of them move a bit faster. But that's me through. Yeah. This one you've just got to be this one you've just got to be patient. Oh, I think there's a bit of a Remember this is quite an old game, so sometimes there'll be a few weird graphical things kicking about. Oh, have we got to take him out? Haha! <laughs> yeah! <coughs> so... Let's bask in the castle destruction there, because that one was a bit more difficult. Yeah, that one was a little bit... The challenge ramped up a little bit there. Yeah, <laughs> it's quite a strange one. Then you see the castle... Go... Bump! Right on that hill's head. Yeah, hills can get... Beaten up and kind of with plasters.
And there's... So there's Forest of Illusion. So this is where this gets a little bit more cryptic. Um, there are multiple paths to this. And some of the levels on multiple paths have multiple paths as well. So it's it's a, a bit of a pain. But what I think I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to go back so you can get to see the other path. The other path is... So I got it wrong. It's the top one that's two levels. Just because we're feeling a bit crazy. And just so that we can see we've done quite a lot of levels here. Yeah, this level is, I would say, definitely harder. My tip for this one is keep jumping. You notice these bounce up and down? Yeah, these ones go up and down. And this is where doing the switch palaces can be really, really helpful. Yeah, just keep keep jumping. Yeah. This one's a little bit of a race, this bit. Don't know where you're gonna, what you're gonna get. Yeah, you've got to prepare to make crazy leaps. And there's a little bit of jeopardy at the end. <laughs> it doesn't really matter too much if you don't hit the thing. So I might be doing that a lot less in these levels, just because th although they help you get lives, it's all about timing. Right, this one again is it's not moving screen, thankfully, but it's just as annoying. Although you can, if you can get up enough speed, you can use your your cape and you can fly over the top of it. Yeah, and if you've got Yoshi there, you could add a... Oh, for goodness sake. I'm spinning too much. Could have had the chance to fly there. With Yoshi. Oh. Hit detection there, let me down. This is crazy getting him on this though. I often find that we or she on this level. I get him and I end up ditching him. See what I mean? It's just madness. And we're through. So yeah, you've noticed there that those levels definitely are 
harder. But definitely a lot more of a challenge, a lot more random. So that's the two routes. Now I haven't done these for a while, so <laughs> we may be doing some of these multiple attempts. It is called Forest, forest Evolution for a reason. Oh! <laughs> or Forest of Fail. Right, let's give that another go. It is definitely harder without... Without Yoshi. Let's try and hit that. That's the best way to get rid of them, if you haven't got Yoshi. If you step on them, they go absolutely bananas at you. No! Going through this quite as quickly. Oh. Right, you'll notice there. I'll just go back for a second. Oh. Get rid of you. Is there's an insane jump. There's a key in that box. Oh! Right. And I think we'll stop the episode there.